Welcome back, tech enthusiasts. Today, we have an exciting unboxing and setup video for the highly anticipated Argon 1 V2 case for Raspberry Pi 4. Let's dive right in and see what this case has to offer. Here it is, the Argon 1 V2 case. The packaging looks sleek and professional, giving us a glimpse of what's inside. Let's open it up and take a closer look. The Argon 1 case is now better than ever as it has many new features to improve its functionality while still maintaining the features and form factor that made the case great. Upon opening the box, we find the Argon 1 V2 case itself, a comprehensive instruction manual, and a few additional accessories. The box includes following items, one aluminum cover, one ABS base, one built-in cooling fan, one set heat sink pad, one set screws, one extension board, one user manual, one package box, it does not include Raspberry Pi. The instruction manual provides detailed step-by-step -step guidance on setting up the Argon 1 V2 case. It covers everything from hardware installation to software configuration, ensuring a smooth experience for users. Now we'll walk you through the step-by-step -step process of assembling this fantastic case for your Raspberry Pi 4. Let's get started. First, let's make sure we have all the components we need. The Argon 1 case, Raspberry Pi 4, power supply, micro SD card with the operating system, peripherals, and a screwdriver if required. Let's begin the assembly process. Step 1. Connect the HDMI audio board to the Raspberry Pi. Align the board with the HDMI and audio ports on the Raspberry Pi and press it firmly into place. Use a flat surface to make sure that Raspberry Pi and HDMI audio board are securely attached. Next, we will take the top of the case and turn it upside down. On the side of cooling fan, we can see two support posts beside the cooling fan. Unpack the content of the small pouch and you will get sticky cooling pads along with other screws. Carefully remove the plastic skin and stick the cooling pads on these the two poles next to the cooling fan. Next, we need to carefully connect the Raspberry Pi to the power and cooling board. Locate the GPIO pins on the Raspberry Pi. Align the pins with the corresponding pins on the GPIO connector inside the case. Please make sure the micro SD card is not inserted to the Raspberry Pi during installation. Carefully press the Raspberry Pi onto the GPIO connector, ensuring that all the pins make proper contact. Now it's time to secure the Raspberry Pi to the case. Depending on the case version, there might be two or four shorter flat head screws provided. Use a screwdriver to tighten the screws and hold the Raspberry Pi in place. Great! With the Raspberry Pi securely attached to the case, we can move on to the next step. Close the bottom cover and fasten it with the longer round head screws provided. Stick the rubber footings on the four round ring spaces near each corner of the bottom cover. This will hold the case firmly on the slippery surface or accidentally sliding off the table. Now you can insert the micro SD card in the SD card slot space provided under the case. It's important to have the micro SD card properly set up with your desired operating system before assembling the Argon 1 case. Power up your Raspberry Pi by connecting it to a USB Type-C port at the back of the Argon V2 case. After connecting the power cable, press the power button at the back of the case once to power on the Raspberry Pi. To be able to use the case to the full extent, it is recommended to install the script offered by Argon 40. To install Argon 1 power button and fan control, you need to follow following steps. 1. Connect the Raspberry Pi to the internet. 2. Open terminal in Raspbian via PuTTY to initiate the installation of Argon 1 script. 3. Type the text below in the terminal to initiate installation of Argon 1 script.
4. Reboot Argon 1 Fan Speed Upon installation of the Argon 1 script by default, the settings of the Argon 1 Pi 4 cooling system are as follows, 55 degrees Celsius, 10%, 60 degrees Celsius, 55%, 65 degrees Celsius, 100%. However, you may change or configure the fan to your desired settings by clicking the Argon 1 config icon on your desktop, or via terminal, by typing and following command Argon 1 config. You can choose to always run the fan by typing 1 after running the above command, or else you can update the fan speed at different temperatures by selecting option 2. Argon 1 power button functions. In off state if you short press the power button, it will turn on the Raspberry Pi. In on state if you double tap the power button, it will reboot. In on state if you long press the power button for greater than 3 seconds, it will soft shut down and power cut. In on state if you long press the power button for greater than 5 seconds, it will forced shut down. Color coded GPIO pins. The case was designed with one main purpose, protecting the Raspberry Pi without compromising the full functionality of the motherboard. The built-in PCB board extends the GPIO pins of the Raspberry Pi with the pins being color-coded to easily identify the pin functions. Also, the pins are clearly labeled for convenient use. When the pins are not in use, they're covered and protected by a magnetic removable top. This makes the pins accessible at all times, allowing the Raspberry Pi to be used in various electronics projects. The new Argon 1 V2 case features two full-size HDMI connectors, which are converted from the original mini HDMI connectors available on the Raspberry Pi 4. This makes it easier to use your existing HDMI cables rather than needing to buy mini HDMI cables separately. Along the side of HDMI port we have USB power port and headphones out. Rest of the ports are the direct ports of Raspberry Pi which includes four USB ports and a LAN port. Normally a Raspberry Pi gets powered as soon as you connect it to the power supply and does not have a power button on board. Well, Argon 1 V2 can change the way you interact with your Raspberry Pi 4. With the power button installed on the case, you can easily turn on your Raspberry Pi and perform safe shutdowns, reboots and forced shutdowns. Gadgets Pod. Understanding Technology.